Peter, 46 points, you must be pleased with that performance. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was um, actually uh, what we planned to do. Um, we trained all week for it and obviously um, the conditions were pretty good as well. The field was pretty good and uh, we just stuck to game plan and came with a uh, win. We got a few things to fix up but if we'll be ready, we should be ready by round one. You mentioned you've been training well. Uh, what's it been like? Because it's really your first pre-season at Wakefield. Yeah, yeah. Um, actually enjoying it uh, at the moment. Not enjoying the cold day, but uh, we had a bit of snow the other day. It was uh, pretty fun. Um, I think, in a way, um, it's a lot better than last year because we hardly had anyone here last year for pre-season. And this year, since we, there's a lot more players, and we're, 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 um, so we're, um, as a group now, uh, leading up to the first game should be um, well. You must be pleased with your middle unit today. Uh, it's a later platform for you and Maka to work off. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're working really hard in that um, department. Um, obviously, Weber's got us boys um, and he's drilled into us that it always starts from up front and like in every um, every team, um, they're just working twice as hard as well. So we just got to um, bring our A game every week. And I'm impressed having been with the new signings, especially Lapini Payer and Mikel Simon because they, they took some big carries for us today. and. Yeah, yeah, they, they make a they make a huge impact on the team um, with their experience as well, and the likes of hopefully Kirky coming back uh, injury free, and I think we've got Matty Ashes out as well. Scroots Anderson, I've uh, got decent forward pack. We just gotta hopefully we rotate take it, rotate them around a bit, and should be on the front foot hopefully. Yeah, not only do we rough it up in the middle, we also play some good stuff. I'm going to look into good ball. Um, uh, especially Jared when he came on, um, I'm really impressed with, yeah. with the rugby you've been playing. Yeah, yeah. Um, Jared, man, he's just unbelievably fast. He, you don't know where he hits it from. And, like everyone else, everyone's just working hard off the field. And um, hopefully um, yeah, we can bring it on um, game, uh, first round. Last season you played a lot of half-back and a lot of hooker. Uh, do you think you found your home at, at hooker this season? Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Um, I enjoy playing hooker now, especially... I don't mind starting all off the bench. Um, I, f I found it um, <coughs> actually quite easier than playing half. There's not much as much pressure, but you got to do a lot more work, and there's a lot of workload that comes with it. So uh, my mindset is just to hopefully just get and do the job to the best of my ability and do it for the team. And do you think uh, you're all ready for the Castleford game, big local derby? Yeah, yeah. Um, like I said, we've got a few more things to fix up. You can see how they didn't feel their strongest team. Uh, but in a way, we, we stuck to our game plan and we stuck to our structures. And defensively, if we can fix a few things up, even our attack as well, we should be ready for game one. Good result, good performance. Thanks, Peter. Cheers, mate. Thanks.